look at this, y'all. So our plane is delayed by a very long time, which is crazy because we were supposed to leave like a whole hour ago. We're leaving at 1.30 now. It's kind of crazy because now we get to Miami at 4.47, which is close to 5 o'clock when we were supposed to get there at 3 o'clock. But yeah, let's try this sweet potato. <laughs> Say hi. What up, gang gang? He's done with his food. He got a whole gloss on yeah. there. Say hi. Nice to you. My girl, my surgery sister. I'm so excited, y'all. She's gonna get surgery with me. We're gonna get surgery together. We're gonna be two bad bitches. We're literally in the middle of eating, and they literally called me from. United Airlines saying that we were boarding. Oh wow, oh, I'm over here thinking there was not gonna outside. be a line. And look, this huge line. Guys, we weren't able to board till now because you know, there was like snow and ice on our plane, which is crazy. And we were literally in the middle of eating. Like, look, she look, got her food. I'm about to eat this. Stuff. My man got my food. You know, Doug got his eat food, it. okay. First flight was supposed to be at 12, 18. It's now 4.35, 4.35 p.m. It's been like four hours, that's crazy. My boyfriend is literally so lit right now, babe. What you got this cook? What's in here? I cannot believe him. It's like four hours later and he's like super, super late. But I don't blame him. If I wasn't getting my surgery, I would have been right along with him. And people just been trying us left and right. So I think it's smacked up real quick. Why are you laughing? Huh? What's funny? What's funny? That I'm supposed to be quiet? Like what? <laughs> Did it must be it's, it must be quiet hours. Yeah, I get there. Yo, over there, tell him something. So what? Tell him something. It's quiet hours. It's quiet hours. It must be ten o'clock. Yeah, yeah. Oh my God, guys, we're literally not even moving. Like, Tulia, how? What time do you think we're actually gonna get to Miami? Our Bible time is 8:01 p.m. I think we'll get there at 8:01. I think we'll get there at 7:50. 7:50? Yeah. I get to sooner than later. Oh, by the way, if you guys are wondering why she's not sitting next to her man, Talia's supposed to be sitting right there. She's not sitting next to her man because tell him. None of us want to get into it, but these guys are too lit right now and they're getting into it again. Later that night. So guys, we finally made it. After so many hours. I want you guys to know, we were supposed to be on our plane and take off at 12.18. It's 11. No, no. that's not the right time. It's 12.30 a.m. It's 12.30 because the, the hour goes back. You know, where we come from in Texas, the hour's mm. back. Dang. So he got the actual time of phone. Show him, babe. Show I don't got my phone. My oh, your charging. phone's dead. But it's 12.30 a.m. This is like ridiculous. We had the worst delay today yeah. over nine hours what no. it wasn't even no snow for real it was just man i don't know what they were doing no they just weren't doing their job yeah it was terrible y'all and then the plane ride was a little shaky I oh, got a, no it was i got a little scared like two three times but it's okay we made it it's about to be crazy y'all you know surgery pre-op is tomorrow and then the next day is surgery i'm excited y'all i'm so so excited so y'all make sure to stay tuned because i'm taking y'all with me throughout this whole journey y'all gonna see it all how you feeling baby nervous i am nervous it's okay baby. i am nervous but i'm in good hands like she said so we're good great hands okay guys so i'm at my pre-op right now and i'm doing some paperwork this is a lot of paperwork like two whole things of paperwork this is crazy way too much she asked so many questions what's up guys what's up guys i didn't even see you recording i know right i was so quiet with it <laughs> no have you ever any serious trouble no mm. are you wearing removable no I'm nervous because this is like a big surgery like this is a big procedure y'all like it's nothing 
Like it's not a walk in the park. It's gonna be hard, but you got this, man. Chill out, man. Stop. Okay, but you got this. <laughs> I know, I know, I got you this got for this, sure. Man, I got you're this. strong. I'm gonna take a look at your skin. Come towards me. Are you planning to get pregnant in the next uh, few months? No. Next year? No. Okay. Just wanna make sure. Yeah, do you want you me to release that? Yeah, sorry about that. No, that's you could keep it as is. I'm not gonna expose you too much. Just enough to see. Okay. Obviously, you do know the laxity of the skin. Mm -hmm. Laxity means st st the stretch marks. Mm -hmm. It's not too elastic. Okay. Why? Because you had children and you had one like eight months ago mm -hmm. so I don't expect do you see the, these stretch marks mm -hmm. what we see here look look how they are see them yeah this means your skin has been stretched out by the by the pregnancy mm -hmm. or sometimes people are not pregnant but they gain weight right and they you know and when it shrinks in it leaves you these are basically what it, what it leaves you is a dermis which is the skin part of the skin is a dermis we call mm -hmm. but it's inelastic it's stretched this it's distorted you know, so it's a little damaged skin. Do you see here? Yeah. Look at the skin here. Look at the skin here, for example. You don't see that. Perfect. So after lipo, that skin will shrink in great because the elasticity of this, look how it go back in. This is, see how it's uh, wrinkly? Mm -hmm. So this will, will shrink, but you have to compress quite a bit. Mm -hmm. But it will not shrink as good as the waist and as good as the top. Because look, no damage of the skin, okay. right? Skin damage around here. This is why when you compress, mm -hmm. try to compress upward. Mm -hmm. Okay. So the skin shrink, meaning when you put the foam, put the foam, don't let the foam push you down. You push you down, it's gonna shrink, and it's gonna shrink even more mm -hmm. to hide it. Mm -hmm. So let it shrink in and upward so you can have the navel show it. So y'all, I just finished eating dinner. Um, right now I am actually editing a YouTube video for the Trench family, but y'all are gonna see more here. Like being on my personal channel, you're gonna see like the raw uncut footage. So this is the night before surgery. Like it's literally dark outside. Look at that. Dark outside. It's what time is it? Let me see. It's 8.16, so I didn't just get back from pre-op, but not too long ago. I feel like the day was like so long. We had to go pick up our prescriptions. There was like so so mind you let me see there were so many prescriptions y'all look at all this i'm gonna tell you guys um i'm gonna show you guys everything i feel like this is like a haul <laughs> so we got here the i don't know <laughs> i don't know it's whatever this is called fluconazole whatever the heck um these are some injections like blood thinners um guys these are some really long names but basically one two three four and then five i think there's like six different prescriptions if i'm not mistaken but that's a lot of stuff so we had to go get that filled and then um yeah so right now i'm about to take this pre-op pre-surgery drink oh, look at that y'all not sponsored by the way not sponsored at all but apparently you know we've seen a lot of girls having surgery take these drinks like the night before surgery you know just to have some thing to keep you hydrated just like pedialyte gatorade you know water things like that but i haven't drink a lot of water and i literally have one more hour left for me to eat and drink anything so I have to stop at nine o'clock my surgery is at like seven in the morning and i need 10 hours so i if i'm not mistaken girl math is a little off sometimes but i think it's good so i cannot eat nothing else new time for surgery 8 30 a.m please confirm what all right so new time for surgery 8 30. okay so confirm Good morning. Good morning, you guys. I just woke up. It's 6.52 a.m. I have to take a shower right now. It's the, literally the morning of surgery today, y'all. Today is January 17th, 6.53 a.m. And I am about to get in the shower. You know, I have to shower with Hippoclens, which is a antiseptic, antimicrobial skin cleanser. I probably said that wrong, but I have to shower with Hippoclens. Um, 
Well, really, you could just shower with any like antibacterial soap, but they recommended a cleanse. So this is what we have. I showered with it last night already, so that's why it's open. It's red. It's weird. And it's super liquidy, so yeah. Anyways, I have to make sure to wash my body really, 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 really good. Especially like, you know, very important areas like the groin, you know, the belly button, like stuff like that. So I just have to make sure to do that. And then I have to do this hair. As y'all can see, it looks a mess, but it's freshly washed. It only has shampoo. Because I couldn't wash my hair with conditioner, which was so annoying. But it makes a lot of sense, you know. Conditioner is more like oily or whatever the heck. So I had to just wash it with shampoo. And now I just like unknotted it. And after showering, I'm most likely just going to put it into braids. Because I feel like that's easier. And then I'm going to go ahead and get ready for my surgery. Y'all, I am in the car. Ready for my surgery. Y'all see me with my robe on and stuff, and my slippers, and my compression socks. That's because this is exactly what I'm going to be wearing when I get out of surgery. So, we're on the way there right now. They changed my time, my surgery time. Like, they pushed it an hour back. So, now it's for 9.30, and I'm about to be there, and get marked up, and just get ready for surgery. So, y'all, this is going to be crazy, babe. Baby, you got this, babe. Are you Church sure? family. Yeah, you got this, babe. Trust. All right, y'all. I'll see you guys after surgery because that's it. That's it. I can't even bring the camera inside no more. It's over with. And I just pray everything goes smoothly and I look good. Period. So I have my, what is it called? Bonnet? Whatever the heck. Hair protecting thing. And my dress or whatever. Oh, y'all. I'm excited. But I'm nervous. I'm so nervous. It's too much right now. My blood pressure had to get tw taken twice because I was so nervous. It's okay, I calm down now, so we're all good. All right, you guys, so this is when my surgeon, Dr. Nassif, started marking up my body before surgery, literally right before surgery. He's just, you know, doing what he got to do here with my tummy. Oh, my God, looking back at it, oh, my goodness. I'm so glad I got this surgery because, y'all, the results are, like, insane. But, yeah, here he's marking me up. Then he was, like, taking a look at my arms because I got Lipo 360, I got a BBL, I got J plasma, and I also got arm lipo. That's why he's marking up my arms right now and looking at them. This flab, y'all, is gone, completely gone. And then here, guys, they're praying for me. And then here, obviously, he's giving me my lipo suction on my tummy. I didn't get too much footage of this. Guys, this is Wendy from GHS Infusions. Look at her. <laughs> She's an angel. She's, she's, you um, look great. oh my god, I look like poop right now, but, <laughs> but yeah. She looks like poop right now. Oh my god. No, she doesn't. Yes, I do. My, why does my face look so swollen? Because It'll get better, trust me, the first day. It's so, a slow process. I have my IV infusion on right now. Let's see if I can show you. almost done well it's actually done now so yeah um i think i have to pee yeah that's pretty common for it after i do we can go to the bathroom open your legs and squat over or we can use a female urinal no. no or you can use a female urinal we can test it out with the female urinal first you want to try that mm -hmm. okay mm -hmm. Guys, I'm about to pee right now because I really have to pee. <laughs> I just got an IV infusion, so they said that usually after the IV infusion, you pee like right away. And that's not a lie. I just finished that. Is my Baja already unzippered? I'm gonna unzip it now. It's not gonna get caught on my. <laughs> I know you're doing your thing. <laughs> so I'm sick, you little girl. I'm about to be. Okay. Oh, 
Oh, do I pee there? Yeah. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. Wow, this is so like, feels great. <laughs> Y'all, this was honestly the best pee of my life. Just look at my face. Like, I was honestly enjoying this pee so, 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 so much. And this was my very first pee after surgery, y'all. Damn, being a lot. Mm-hmm. Because you had the idea. You've been drinking lots of fluid. You had Gatorade. You had um, liquid IV hydration. So you're very, you're well hydrated. So that's good. But it all has to Oh, my God. Out. Wait, why does my pee smell like that? after surgery typically ew what it's the okay. heck it, it's that first urine that always has that smell <gasps> but it's gonna it's not gonna smell like that ew it's normal my pee does not smell like that i think i'm i'm not done yet take your time take your time i can't wait to put my contacts on because <laughs> i am seeing everything so blurry right now My arms probably don't hurt right now <laughs> because <laughs> it's like mm. <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> yeah. what the hell? Yeah. <sighs> You're doing good. Mm. You're doing very good. I want to see my butt. Wait, can you just lift this up? I want to take it off. So, y'all, I'm not going to lie. Right here, I was, like, so sad. I looked at my butt for the first time, and I felt like it was so freaking huge i was like there's no way like my hips are humongous my ass is huge like y'all i was actually about to cry that's crazy okay that's enough actually i feel so weird again i want to lay down <sighs> yeah i feel weird so guys right here i'm just laying down as y'all can see talia is not there yet she was still in surgery i went into surgery first she went after me and guys i was in surgery for four hours like dr nasif did his thing i'm talking about his thing with me plus i got j plasma so it was a little longer procedure than normal but here i'm just laying down honestly just trying to rest and i have nikita which is my my caretaker um about to get me out of bed she's amazing i love her okay nice and slow just take your time catch your bearings and you're gonna use your strong arms like you did earlier i feel like i was doing the push up yeah <laughs> so you're gonna use your strong arms to push up push 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 Take your time. Slide your leg over, your right leg over. Good, good job. Mm, this feels good right now. Yeah, it's all normal. Yeah. Good job. See? Did you feel a little better? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I just want to take a pause right now and just give a huge, huge, huge shout out to Blushing Dolls Concierge. This is Nikita right here. Um, guys, 
her and her whole team is amazing i honestly couldn't have done it without them i am so so happy that i found them on social media um, when i tell you that they are amazing i feel like they're literally perfect everything they do they're so attentive they're so educational like Oh my God, Just I just can't thank them enough, y'all. I seriously can't. I have so many words to say about them. I'm just so happy. I'm so, so happy. My girl. How are you, babe? Um, you look great. Oh, shit. Okay. Take it slow. You look so good. Just take a look. Mm. <laughs> Amazing. Guys, I look so swollen. On, this is ugly. Mm. Oh, my tongue feels like weird the tip of my tongue I just like I can't feel it by the way my boo thing is here Hi. Talia she just got here so she's in a little more pain right now but she's going to be good Okay. <laughs> I was feeling good until I went to go pee. Is it for her? But I'm good. No, you good now? Yeah, thank you so much. You're amazing. Oh, okay. How are you feeling, babe? <clears throat> I'm feeling better. I am feeling better, but I just took some more pain medicine because my butt was starting to hurt really bad again. Okay. Um, it's on the second floor in the garage. They've been so great here, so I just feel like, hey, How are you? I'm good. Okay. All right, we're going to complain. I'm going to be the one to Yeah, yeah, that's fine. I love you. Good morning, guys. It's currently like, what time is it? 
seven, eight, eight oh six, eight oh six, y'all, and we're eating some fruit right now, making us a good breakfast, making us eggs, um, bacon. I don't know what else, but I'm not gonna lie to y'all. Oh yeah, avocado what? Avocado toast. Mm. Mm. Guys, so. Last night, I forgot to film for y'all. Honestly, not that I forgot. I was just very, like, in pain, bro. The, the pill, the pain pill they gave us, the Oxy, whatever. It's trash. Trash. Everyone has different, you know. Everyone has different reactions to the oxy. I don't know what the difference but I'd rather say that than the other word. I think it is the other word. No, it said oxy probably with something. You're almost right, perfect. You have a thing? Okay guys, well I could have sworn I saw O X Y though. Maybe there's something else that was on the prescription. Okay. So honestly, I don't think it worked for me. Um, I took it, it might've calmed down the pain a tiny bit, not much. But the Tylenol, oh yeah. The Tylenol is where it's at. Took two Tylenols and I felt better like instantly. But I was getting up literally, how often we got up last night to pee, like girl. I feel like we got up like four times to pee and each time we went to pee it was a lot a lot a lot a lot which is really good but my pain all night was probably like a 4.5 it's going up and down up and down but my blood pressure went down a couple times so every time i'll get up and pee i would like literally feel like i'm about to pass out like right so you like mm -hmm. i was getting like i felt so bad because she was really having a hard time I was having such a hard time. Like I would be fine when I'm going to the bathroom to pee and then I would pee and it's like instantly after I peed, I started sweating. I started feeling like lightheaded. Yeah, like alcohol on her glove and like was like going like this to me, like going like this. And bro, that stuff shook me back. The alcohol and then, I forgot. This fan is on, but. This fan in my face because I was sweating so much. And I shook back. <clears throat> but it was happening a lot. But we're here. Mm -hmm. We're going. going. Almost going to be 24 hours in surgery for me. In like two hours. Mm -hmm. And yeah. Guys. Oh, mine's a while away because I got my surgery at like three. Yeah. They took, she was after me and they. I, my surgery took long. A very long time. Four hours. Like at one, they were going to take me and they were like, no, I'm still in surgery with Rachel. And then they came in at 2.30 and they said, oh, it's just done now. Yeah. Yeah, but my surgery took long. He, I also got J plasma. That's why it took a little long because he has to do that after the light bulb. Hey, guys. So... I ate breakfast. I forgot to show you guys, but I had um, eggs, scrambled eggs, avocado, and toast, and turkey bacon. And now I'm back at Miami Life. We're back here for pre for post op for our post op appointment. So today, doctor's gonna check us out, how we're doing. Um, gonna take off our fajas, which I'm really nervous for. I think we'll be fine. And I have my beautiful Nikita. Hi. She's amazing. <laughs> All right, how do I get out of here? Okay, I might have to. Go. Wait. Prop this up? Okay, so you're gonna swing your legs. Yep, towards me. Take your time, okay? Okay. Ooh. Take your time. Damn. Push up. Nice. 
guys so my tongue has been hurting well not hurting but like i feel like uh -huh, down i can't really feel my tongue and it kind of feels weird so i'm over here looking myself in the mirror and bro i bit up out of my tongue <laughs> i had to do it while i was asleep of course like during surgery or or something but like Ew, it's disgusting. I have like a bruise on my tongue. Like I cut my tongue. I don't know if I, I don't know if I cut it, but the anesthesiologist said that like it's common that maybe when you wake up from anesthesia, you start grinding your teeth or like biting hard. So even he even gave me like a warning about my veneers. Mm -hmm. I was like, listen, if it chips or something, it's not like. Our financial responsibility over it. but of course mm. at least i didn't chip my teeth at least you didn't at bite least into your tongue like bite it off. it looks like i almost did yeah you stopped before it did because i'm like why doesn't your tongue hurt it doesn't but now that i look at myself in the mirror for real like with my tongue like it's literally bruised especially that side i can't even feel myself touching it We're at our post stop appointment waiting for the doctor. <laughs> I'm down here right now because my back hurts, but Korea's is a troop. She's a troop. No, you're a troop. I didn't get no deal. Well, asthma and you're still over here doing everything I'm doing. Yeah. I got <clears throat> J Plasma, Lipo 360, BBL, and Arm Lipo. Mm hmm. She got the same thing minus J plasma. She got um chin lipo. Trigger warning, y'all are about to see so much blood. So if you don't want to see it, get out. Compression songs, like I said, for her 10 days. Make sure you're getting up and walking. And I need you to stretch your stretch yourself out a little bit, okay? Yeah. When I remove the faja, let me know if you feel a little dizzy. Being that I'm releasing the compression, sometimes it takes a little bit for the oh. everything to stabilize itself. Okay. Can I turn around like towards the mirror? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. So let me go on this side of you. So I can. Oh! Breathe. Breathe in through your nose and release it with your mouth. I'll go soon. You want to hold my hand? Nope. Sometimes it helps. You can squish me. <laughs> Just breathe in. Oh. Okay. Try not to think about it. What are your names? Uh, your kid's name? I'm sorry, I can't talk right now. <laughs> I'm not trying to be mean. I'm doing. No, it's fun. When you think about something else, it helps. Do you have kids? No. Oh, okay. Scar yeah. Zero like me. Scar Zero like me. Yeah. I have a... I don't really like to. I have time. <laughs> oh. Okay. Oh. You want to hold on to the bed? Oh. On three, take a deep breath, okay? One, two, three, one, two, three. Ah! Fuck! Nice. Look at your booty! I know. Oh, it's burning. Oh, it's gonna burn, but look at your waist. Uh, look at this waist. Uh, Come on. Okay. Relax. Just relax. Do, wow. you, do you see that butt? Yeah, it looks really good. Look at your butt, girl. You look so good. Oh. You should look at your butt on the camera. That's nice. <laughs> it does. It looks really good. She's like, I don't care how good it looks right now. Alright. So like I said, right now this is going to feel stiff and hard. That's normal. It will soften and fluff out, okay? Mm -hmm. How are you feeling? Not bad? Not good? Not good. What do you feel? Uh, lean, lean forward. Lean forward. Let's get you on the bed. Step up on the stepping stool. Step up. Come on, I need you to step up. Lift up, you gotta lift up your leg. There we go. One, two, three. Push up with your legs. Up. Up. 
all the way, like laying down. I want you to lay down there because you're feeling dizzy. I'd rather you lay down than to feel dizzy. Just lift up your needle. Okay. 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 Ok
looks disgusting. It's really gross. I'm so freaking swollen. Yours is not swollen as much as mine. Look at my cheeks. But why is my face so swollen? Like, I know I'm sleeping on my face. Like, literally, like, I'm like, or like this. So, that could be one of the reasons, but it's, it's too much. Also, my blood pressure is high as hell. First, it was at 159 over, I don't know. And then the second time, I just took it, it was at 149. I mean, the first time was at 152 over something. And then the second time, it was 149. So, what the hell? That's considered, like, hypertension. Why are you laughing? It's not funny. I'm not laughing. It's just because you took a pause and you're like... Hypertension. Yeah. <laughs> Bro, I'm a little nervous because... Why is my blood pressure so high right now? My blood pressure is gonna go up and down, up and down, up and down. So we're about to eat this breakfast and then go on a walk up and down the hall. Yep. Two times. I look disgusting. One, two, no, one, and then two. We could try two. I think we can do two. Yeah, I, my butt hurts. <laughs> no, my butt doesn't hurt, guys. It feels sore. How do you feel? I feel very, very, very sore, especially my abdomen area. I feel like we just hit like the most like craziest booty workout. Like, oh my god! Bro, like we did squats, we did lunges, we did everything. The fucking. It feels like we worked out too much. It feels like we worked out so much. Like we worked out like so much. Like we worked out so much. Like three months in a row straight booty by itself <laughs> no arms well my arms you know they're a little sore i got arm lipos i'm surprised the arm lipos are not hurting as much yeah arm lipo but i don't want to hear that <laughs> so my arms don't hurt um it only bothers like because the way we have to sleep is on our stomach and so our arms kind of have to be like this. So mm -hmm. when you move them, they're a little sore, but... We're supposed to keep them straight, but it's hard. It's so hard. Your face is really like this. And then it makes, like, when your face is just like that, it makes kind of your back hurt. Mm -hmm. This is our breakfast. Well, my fruit bowl is almost done, but it did look like that. <laughs> we had some avocado. And Talia spilled that and never picked it up. Why do not... Oh, Aw, damn. <laughs> um. But guys, look at these roses. So these right here... I from Haley. Mm -hmm. She sent it to both of us. Where's the little letter? I don't know. I think it's still in the room. Okay. And then these right here. <clears throat> All right. Hopefully I don't get hit. These right here are from Jalea, my baby. Look, new body who this. Love you best. She is so freaking cute. And then, where are the other ones? Shit. Shit. I don't, even, I don't even want to walk to the room. But look at these beautiful roses over here. These are so nice. So these are from my man. Hey, my man. I'm in no pain at all. Just sore in my butt, you know. I just took off my arm compressions for a little bit because. I wanted them off but guys look at my face this is not fair i keep waking up with my face so swollen oh, i hate it so much but apparently that's what happens because we have to lay on our stomach so all the sweating goes up to our hands and our face I feel so, so ugly. It's disgusting. So guys, I didn't record much after day three post-op other than like my massages and stuff like that. But I didn't really do no like update videos after that. And now I am a week post-op. I feel good. I look good. And my swelling is still going down daily. So stay tuned, y'all, because I am going to be dropping a update video on how i'm feeling i'm gonna do some q a's i'm gonna do a body reveal so 
Y'all make sure to stay tuned for all my videos that are coming out next. And thank you guys so much for watching. I really try to keep it super detailed and raw footage to show you guys the real, the ugly, everything. So, love you guys.